Looks like stream delete on Facebook trying to reconnect. La -dee -dee -da. You got this, Taylor? We're having technical difficulties. Please stand by. No, we're just reconnecting everything. Give it a second. Give it a second. Give it a second. Hold on. <laughs> Looks like Facebook's having an issue there, Taylor. YouTube. Give me a thumbs up if you're fixing it. Okay, cool. All right. We're, uh, yeah, it is podcast. We are here. We're having a couple technical difficulties, and we've been starting a show like this where I just kind of dance around so we get some people in here, and then we can talk about Dean Baptist, the man, the myth, the legend, the, hold on, the... The Caribbean Guru. I like that one. Who we got? Daniel Clark popping on. Mike as Anna. Wait. And wait. And New Z. I'm sorry, man. Mike, what's up? Mike A, you in the house. Ha, thank you, sir, for the play button. Check the uh, tracking. Uh, should be here Monday or Tuesday, but you know how UPS is. But um, we will do a live unboxing it. Bobby in the house. Let's turn this party out. So it looks like the Facebooks are good. So we're just going to chit chat a little while. And then for the people that say, oh, they only have like 10 people on there. Remember, we are broadcasting on our new podcast YouTube, our Big Jeff YouTube, and all of our Facebooks and uh, Twitter and somewhere else. So it's Friday. And I'm in a good mood. I got We got the new... Uh, hats you all saw with the um, hair tricks guy. Uh, you can get it in gray with red with a green bill, or you can get all red with a green bill. And uh, while we're everybody's kicking in now, hello, Joe Cook, Washington State, Sarah Dusty, good evening, Mike. Totally fucked your name up. I'm sorry, it's Mike A. I owe you on that one, bud. Mr. Juan Rogue in the house. Trademark in effect. Hell yeah. We do own the word hair trick and hair tricks. Yes, it is trademark. We have our serial number. Um, nowadays, you have to do that as a business and not that we're just going to go after people for using it, but if they're using it in the wrong sense, then yeah. Uh, they wake up thinking about Big Jeff Audio and they go to bed thinking about Big Jeff Audio. That's my slogan tonight. Well, all right, we got already jumped up over 40 plus. Hey, Ben, let's kick this shit off. Yeah, I'm off. Big Jeff Audio. It's Big Jeff Audio in the chair. Have a seat and relax. Don't be going nowhere. Got guests coming on. They be giving advices. Check out the website for them dope ass prices. Lowest in town. Yeah, that's a fact. He be keeping them down. He's a maniac. Giveaways done every thousand subs. And to any other channel, he show nothing but love. Big Jeff on the mic. You know he get down. What's the name of the show? Well, that's Big Sound. Big subwoofers, yeah, that's the type. Deviant for life. I'm saying smash the light. Can we yow? What is up? Episode 20. And let me first give a shout out for the hater, 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 hater. Yes. Big shout out to all you for helping us out. It is episode 20. No matter where you're watching us on, because we are broadcasting on two different YouTubes, multiple Facebooks, Twitter, etc. I appreciate if you're able to like Aaliyah, you were supposed to be on here tonight. I would have gave you something to get on here, but at least you're in here. Uh, smash the like, smash the share. If you haven't subscribed, do that. Tonight, 
we got some things to talk about. Obviously, most of you uh, saw the big announcement. I even had to screenshot the email just to put a stop. Everyone was saying, oh, it's fake. It's fake. We are the newest online retailer for Kenwood. And why is that such a big deal? They have not put on a online seller in over five years. In fact, today I was on the phone with them doing an interview for a press release. It is huge. What does it mean? It means you all can get some nice high-end units. Uh, if you're into the speakers and the amps, more than welcome. Uh, we will also, also have a application chart being uh, made for our website where you can do year, make, and model. And not just the can what everything will come up. So that's an advantage. Um, so it's it's big news. And there's actually some other stuff on the back end coming in uh, for all the quotes out there that we are losing brands. I'd like beg to differ. The only ones we lost are the ones we said, get out of here. Now, coming up tonight, I have him in the background. Dean Baptist, the man, the myth, the Caribbean lover is here tonight to talk about music wars and something else yes um we also he has a pre-show that we're going to talk about uh and then that is next november the 11th and 12th he and i and us will be at uh the uh lifted florida truck show it is the finals that's going to be big that is the 30th and first we are what they call stage sponsors i Basically, when you walk in, we're going to be right there giving away a bunch of stuff. The Yukon, uh, with its cleanup and redesign, will also be there and some other cool stuff. We actually have one of our faithful supporters. Who is he in here? Where is he? Where is he? Will be coming out and uh, parking with us, too. We'll see if he pops up. All right. Um, new drunk text winner. Hold on before you put it up. I just got done before I came on here reading a stupid comment about the Mark's Digital Amps and, oh, I don't know if they announced the winners, if they even give the stuff away. Yes, everything we do, we give away and we get people to send in their screenshots or pictures of it. And we don't even have to do that. But every week we give away the campaign Get Drunk Text by Big Jeff, where you text the word drunk to 737 Big Jeff, that's 737-244-5333. And each week, somebody gets picked out and gets a drunk text by me, and we give some away. And uh, this winner for this week, hold on, I pushed the wrong button. Here we go. Is Herman Gathers. There's the screenshot of his text you are getting that amp kit awesome 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 congratulations okay tonight we are talking to the man dean himself who is one uh man he's a base head he's a car show guy he's somebody to look up to uh this is what we need in our lives more of this uh dean baptist we're going to take a short short video break and we're coming back with the man himself musical war base battle and car show is back again bigger than ever november 11 and 12 2023 in apopka florida amazing cars with impressive car audio builds will be there for you to see enjoy and get some ideas from be ready for a spectacle of sound but enough talk Let's take a look at this awesome one. That's wow. what this podcast does different, and you see others following it now, but 20 weeks ago, 
you weren't getting on the podcast like a show. And that's what this is supposed to be, dedicating to the people that are coming on, like you, Mr. Dean Baptist, and uh, speaking the truth. You know, I want to get in the Sundown show, obviously, there. Uh, let's start there first, and we can get into music boards. So you kicked, excuse me, you kicked ass, right? I, I mean, tried to, politely. Right. Yeah. So I heard you were the what there? I mean, you walked away with something. Yeah. Um, in my class, I, I walked away with first place for Mecca, um, best overall sound in Extreme Modified. Yeah. You know, and that's cool. And, and you've been doing this for a while, and it's cool that you're still kicking butt, right? Because sure. you constantly have people making changes and coming up out of the woodworks. Man, and listen. People, right. People are that's changing every time beautiful. and upgrading. Yep. Right. And you're still showing that something that was built how long ago? What was the last Ooh. build change was done? How long ago? I was just talking to my boy, Big Baby, who actually did the last build. Um, I'll say about five, six years plus. Right. Yeah. So yeah. you're still kicking butt. So that means that's how, you know, it's like you go into a house, you know, you have some houses that were remodeled and they look old and you have a house remodeled, <laughs> like new, right? And, yeah. and that's what I'm trying to get to that you know, uh, Big Baby, as you call him, was the one that did it, and it's still up to date. You know what I'm saying? Correct. Uh, Correct. So Correct. That, that's really cool. Um, let's talk about, well, you brought something to my attention. I kept seeing these flyers. So we have Music Wars, which we're, we're happy to be a sponsor here. But you have a pre-show before that. So can you yes. tell us what that is and, and what about it? Yeah, so the Loud and Clean car show, it's something me and uh, two other promoters – put together and the purpose of this pre musical wars car show is to actually assist with the shipping of a lot of the cars from the Virgin Islands. So I'm personally from the Virgin Islands. I don't want to be biased, but um, it's pretty, it's very expensive as you would know, being right. that you go to show to show as well as I do. It's crazy expensive interstate. So you could imagine shipping a car from the Virgin Islands all the way to Florida and then still attending a show. You know right. what I'm saying? And the car ships into Miami, doesn't even get here. So you still have to pay for it to get from Miami to Orlando. And you're then actually Orlando. doing this to financially help them. Assist, yes, correct. So uh, this yes. show is just for that. This isn't about no, this no. to get them over here for the actual show. This okay. is just to help assist all the people who want to come and travel from the islands right. to music so, awards. For the local people that can go to that show, what, where is it same place, time, yep. date? So it's going to actually be October 15th. Um, you can check it out on Musical Wars car page as well. It's going to be October 15th, the um, Sunday, the same address, 2346 Volcan Road in Apopka, Florida, 32703. So if everybody wants to go to that locally, there's plenty of people in Central Florida. Um, call it a get ready for the real show, but it also helps out. Um, so, you know, big, big ups to that. Uh, I see some comments in here. Looks like somebody asking, yeah, you can go to bigjeffaudiodealer.com and then click become a dealer. Uh, you have to fill out an application. You have to be an actual shop. You don't have to be in a shop. Uh, I'm looking for the next big Jeff that's working out of his garage uh, to come in wholesale and we'll, we'll build you up together. Okay, so let's talk about Sunday. What stands out the most to you about that show? What was the, I mean, what is it? What, what about that show you still think about? Right now, as far as just overall with the, car, with the show itself? Yeah, yeah. Honestly, to me, sun, that was probably the best sundown show I've ever been to um honestly and overall i could honestly say all the vendors or all the different boots your booth um down for sound um concrete audio whoever was there what i loved about it most is that's the most i've seen packs of people just gather and everybody's just enjoying themselves yeah. like from the youngest to the oldest that show was absolutely crazy i was blown away i mean one First show we went to that far away, bringing all the employees and everything else is no. You had a big team. team. No, right. no. <laughs> you right. had a so team. We get there and we kind of got there a little bit later than I was expecting. Plus, people got their way earlier than usual. Yeah. They said. And by the time we got set up, we're already giving stuff out. Mm -hmm. um, we ended up even closing down, I think, close to three because we gave out. We already hit like over 800 
people, right? And we gauge that on scan codes and the reviews and that. So we were giving out stuff left and right. I didn't even have time to do anything. And I'm like, man, we still have another nine hours back. Yeah. It started to slow down a little, but it was incredible. It was just, I don't know, man. It was just really cool. All the people coming up and, you know, I don't know, man. That's what we go there for. Yep. It's not to even so. Now, Sundown, because we're a Sundown distributor yeah, and yeah. online mm-hmm. seller, they brought product out for us to sell there. But, man, it was just didn't even have time for that. Yeah, we got rid of some product, but it wasn't even it. It was more just everybody coming up. Giving back, yeah. Young kids with their parents, and they wanted the chain and the shirts. And it was just, man, it was it was awesome. There wasn't enough time. And, uh, you know, next year for sure we go up and stay over before. You know, people don't realize – just going to the show alone is a pain, but bringing yep. the whole crew with it, yeah, multiple vehicles. We didn't even set up the money booth and everything else. You know, we just like all of a sudden, bam, we just got to go because there's just people everywhere. So um, we're going to do things a lot different at the show uh, next weekend. We'll be obviously it's only a couple hours away, a lot yes, easier. It's way easier, correct? Right. right. And we're gonna, man, we're coming strong. Uh, I don't know if you all saw, but we made a hater starter pack ben can you bring up the hater starter pack okay so we will be giving away the glasses the chain and what you don't see in this picture is a little uh fake pinky ring with a money sign on it and um we will be giving uh those out at the show uh you know it's just fun to see everybody wearing the chain and and i'm sure people will be wearing the glasses tonight i forgot we always do giveaways everybody excuse me we're giving away tonight one of those new hater packs with the new hair tricks hat tonight. Uh, and we also giving away another Black Diamond Audio Double Din. We'll start off with the hair tricks hat and the hater starter pack. I need you to comment the word haters. H A T E R S. Haters. Comment that. We'll pick a winner here. Now, let's talk about Music Wars. Um, I know we talked about it before, but let's talk to people that don't know. Tell me what Music Wars is about. What was it created for? And and what is it now to you and to the people that do it? Um, Musical Wars. It is, honestly, it's our passion. It's our way of showing what, what we love and how we love it. Um, in Ooh, the first- see, I told you. Look at the window. That's Aaliyah. <laughs> Alien. Alien. Uh-huh. Okay. Alien. Alien. Right. Yeah. Sorry, I don't interrupt. Okay. No, we're back. So yeah, um, music core is honesty, man. That it, it makes me happy to see it because we started off, like I said, something crazy small. We started going to car washes and just having little battles and friendly battles and everything with different people, and just we just decided one day to, you know, we said, "F it." Let's go. Let's start to make this official. Let's start going to different shows. Let's start showing out. Um, and then we finally decided, you know what? We went to Mecca. We went to Base Wars. We went to ISPLO. We went to all the different organizations. And we realized people, they have bass. They love bass. Bass is amazing. I, I'm not a hater. I love ba- I love music. I don't care what you have. I love it. But we love overall sound quality. We love being able to be loud and clean. We want that when your system plays, it's not just bass. It's not just mids and highs or the voceteos just blaring or screaming. You know, we're in the middle. So there's a the voceteo guys, and then there's a the bass guys, and then there's musical or it's in the middle. We're that bridge that brings music together. So basically, imagine listening to headphones, that total complete sound. You got the mid bass, the mid range, the tweeters, the horns, the highs, everything. That's what we love. And that complete sound. So Mecca actually does something similar. And I actually brought these out because I never get to brag on them a little bit. But this is my first world championship ring. This is my second world championship ring. And this is my third world championship (laughs) ring. And you know what? Here's a perfect instance with all the crap that goes on in the background against the big Jeff Audio platform. Here's another type. You guys can work. Everybody can work together. Correct. 
yeah. have fun and do what they do. It, the, you know what I'm saying? And even have competition in the middle. You know yep. what I'm saying? And and that's awesome, man. So, you know, this is our first year with you, and I told you we're going to ride out. I'm stoked to go, man, just because it will be nice to be in that free zone feeling. And that's and what I feel like it's going to Honestly, I've I seen you building up and build, and you could honestly compete with it, too. Let me know, man. They would love you. I know you're yeah. just getting it, so you might get your ass whooped a little bit at first, you know, because it's the, it's we have the saying, when you just build a, a vehicle, don't expect to come out the gate winning. You know what I'm yeah. saying? You have to, and this will be your first time in our yeah. organization. You yeah. have to learn it. You have to learn the songs, learn your judges, learn what we 100%. look for. And, and, and then this, this is originally, and this is what so pissed me off about it originally. It was supposed to be built and the whole seven months was supposed to be videoed and cameraed so people could live through the build. Gotcha. And nothing wrong. I've heard all types of crap out there. Originally, the shop, he has done other builds from other vehicles while he worked at a shop. Very good. That's what blows me away the most about what happened and had his own place. And I always like to keep things in the family, right? Correct. If they're going to purchase for me, I mark with him. And long run, really bad. Uh, TJ, I've dealt with when I first opened my shop, and he was actually my first DS18 dealer. And just over the years, you know, other things. So I got to give extreme big, you know, they've only had it a little over two weeks and have almost rebuilt the majority of it. And, um, man, it's, it's really nice looking. It is. I love the trunk. It I is. love it's, that trunk setup. Man, it cool. is so yeah. clean. It's very uh, clean. We're not or we're never planning to to tell him we're beating him an SPL or this that. We wanted to build some fun that looked good, lose some hair, made people go, holy crap, that looks good. A demo really vehicle, cool. basically. Yeah. 100%. 100%. And, uh, you know, we plan to do another one. Massive Audio wants to sponsor one front to back, and that would be more on that SBL level. Gotcha. This is kind of that build that people would love to have but can't, right, financially or time. Yep. And it just wanted it to be cool. You know what I'm saying? Like we're talking about your car, uh, you know, something that will be cool for a while, and that's what it is. So we're going to have a good time there. I can't wait. We're going to no, give it to us. It's going to be a good time. Um what year how many times has music wars happened honestly so this is our fifth annual but music wars honestly probably has been going on uh, for a good seven years now honestly six or seven years before we realized it was musical wars um and again people ask what does musical wars mean the name says it it's a musical battle um and to explain what we do so you, you have your cars, you have your overall sound. We listen to your tweeters, your horns, your mid bass, your mid range, and your overall sound. So when a judge walks your car, you want to make sure your, your doors sound like your back doors and your trunk if you have a trunk set up. And we also put speakers outside the car. So there's different classes for everyone. There's from factory setups, bikes, anything that you could put, a, put music in, we have a class for you. So don't think, oh, I don't, I don't have a, Jeff set up or a Dean set up, I can't compete. No, you can compete with one, with just replacing your factory speakers to having the biggest stun wall in the world. It doesn't matter. We have a class for you and we try, we keep it fair. We're non-biased. We love music loud and clean. So this is an event, if you're able to make to it, that is for somebody starting out and somebody to mm -hmm. We want to come out to that. Okay. Um, and then you have another show. What's next after that? Because this is not the only one you do, correct? The You're talking about the October 15th show? Right. No, no. Yeah, yeah October. Yeah, so October is before the November. And the October 15th show, actually, that's the mini music awards where we will have Mecca there. We will have, we will have ACCL there. Um, we will have the yeah. musical wars battles there. So we have what's after that? Don't you have another one? After October is November, just the two shows. Okay, and then you don't do it again until the following until year. Until the following year, correct. Yeah, gotcha. okay, correct. so this thing gets hyped up and built. Correct. Year right. Every, so I'll tell you why. We used to do it four times. <laughs> we used to do it four times a year. We cut it down to three times a year, and we cut it down to two. Because like you just said about your build, it's everybody wants it, but not everybody could afford it. And right. you could imagine 
these shows, everybody rebuilds completely. Like people tear down, upgrade, buy new batteries, amps, speakers. And you can imagine trying to do that four times a year. That's crazy expensive. You can imagine building your build every year or a couple times a year. You, you don't want to do that. You want to have it timeless. You want to do it once, right? And that's it. You know what I'm saying? And we, we were like, you know what? It's not about the money. It's, a, it's about what we love. And it gives everybody an opportunity to start from January to November to get your car together. You have no excuse. You have the whole year to plan your car build. You know what I'm saying? You have a year to do it. So, I mean, you had your car going for a while. Is there another build on the horizon? Yeah. Yes, there okay. is. So the orange one that you you had the video of, that's the hot topic. And then I have a blue one. That's the cold topic. Okay. So a, is, that's in the process or that's coming mm, up? It's it's in the middle. Um, I brought it out temporarily to uh, Made a Steel, if I'm not mistaken. I brought it out to Made a Steel when it first, the doors just got built by um, John. Actually, you had him on the live um, last week, if I'm not mistaken. Epicenter yes. John. Yep. yep. John, 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 built, yep. Yep. John built my doors. Big Baby built my base box for that one as well. And we brought it out to Made of Steel. It made its grand entry. I went to a couple car shows. It won just about the, the past three or four car shows that it been to right out the gate. Um, and then I took it back and I'm about to make it pretty. So it wasn't pretty, but now I'm about to turn it pretty. Is Blu-ray going? Oh, I guess everybody knows about Blu-ray. Hey, and Ben, load up the wrap for the BMW. I want to bring that up. Uh, so, so, so Blu-ray, is it going to be ready for this show? Probably not. That's what they're asking. Is Blu-ray going to be ready for this show? Which one's? Oh, no. His Blu-ray is is a car from, actually, the Blu-ray he's talking about, that's from A. Morris. He's actually talking about, he's from St. Croix. He's actually one of the builders who does okay. a lot of fabrications down in the islands and here locally, Texas, all over. Um, he's asking about one of the cars that we're actually helping assist coming to the to Florida to the Music Awards. So as far as I'm concerned, yes, he's going to be there. Gotcha. If you haven't done it already, go ahead and comment the word haters. Hold on. Hater, 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 hater. And then you can win, which we're going to pull that here shortly, the new Hair Tricks hat and the Hater Starter Pack. And Ben, you want to pull a winner and we will get. I know I caught him off guard. Oh, go ahead, Dean. Announce the winner. Benjamin Harrison. Benjamin Harrison, you are a winner of the first. Well, I have the first one, but you're a winner of the <laughs> You will be the winner of the first hater kit. That'll be the starter pack. Contact 737 Big Jeff. My team will get it. We're going to, uh, well, you know what? The next giveaway is the uh, Double Din touchscreen 6.2 from Black Diamond. Go ahead and comment the word diamond. Uh, we're going to do a, another short video break and be back on with Dean. We're going to talk more about whatever. Hey, it's Big Jeff coming to you with a big big announcement you've seen on the podcast you've seen in many posts we keep saying we have a big announcement and it took a lot of time actually it was actually started back almost a year ago but really came about in the last three months some of the reasons were all this online attention we've been getting our youtube our facebook the increase in our sales our marketing sponsoring race cars and even the hater squad was a part of this because it just showed how far the reach of the big jeff audio platform is but we are the first online retailer approved all the way to japan that's how big of a deal it is i would just crazy to announce your newest kenwood online retail seller yes we got approved by kenwood direct with kenwood as a online retailer which means we'll have all their products on our website. We should have product as soon as uh, early next month. That no matter what people say, I've read comments saying, oh, this place is losing their brands and more are pulling out. It's a lie. We keep getting bigger. We keep announcing this. And I'll tell you what, there's a couple more behind this. They're about to jump on board on the Big Jeff audio platform. So you heard it first. 
Uh, we will be carrying all the Kenwood product, head units, double dins, navigation, speakers, amplifiers. And now you can get high-end double dins and, and uh, man, for you base heads that need high-voltage RCAs, quality equipment with the Kenwood name on it. I'm Big Jeff. Next time for another big news break. Man, I love this. I love it. I love you. See ya. Um, you know, it's a big deal. Um, Kenwood, you know, a lot of these manufacturers are starting to see the use of online sales. Obviously, a lot of brick and mortar shops don't stock as much. You don't have as many shops you used to have years ago. Yeah, uh, everything is going online. They don't just give it out there because you have to follow map. You have to have the capital. You have to have the platform. You know, you know things like this. It's not like buying in with five grand. I'll tell you. That. Um, you know, it's big sales. So this is huge, man. It's just huge to be that. We were doing the, uh, uh, I was on the phone with Kenwood doing a, ple a press release that'll be out. And, and it's just big, you know, getting lines like Kicker and Rockford, you know, big name brands and, and even, you know, DS18 and Massive Audio and all these different brands uh, really is, is good for the customer. Um, it gives them so much choice. And that's what we're real happy about. Let me ask you this. I know you're, you know, a rogue guy. What what was it before that? You don't want to say? Great question. Um, okay. Actually, I, you actually I opened like, the door. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I hit a <laughs> <laughs> Nah, you opened the door for exactly okay. what I needed. Um, so my first sponsorship or product that I ran um, was PRV. Um, okay. From PRV. By the way, PRV is one of our sponsors from Music Wars. They sent us a whole bunch of product, as well as Big Jeff's going to be giving away stuff. PRV sent a whole bunch of stuff for us to give away as well for the first, second place. All the winners, we have free giveaways at the gate. Listen, between Big Jeff, us, and all the other uh, sponsors, we got a lot for you guys. So trust me, this is the show. Can we get, get some of that funky noise? going on there jeff yeah. <laughs> this is the show you want to come to to get some free stuff hey 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 <laughs> no, but that's, yeah. you know what? that's what it should be about I, yeah I, I'm honest with you when we went to made of steel people were walking up and saying how much is it and i'm like what do you mean like, why am I going to charge you to put my name on you? you exactly. Know, like, exactly. Some of the more expensive items, the umbrellas or chairs. Yeah, but we would charge them like, I'm not trying to make money on them. So when they were coming up, we're like, no, it's free. Just scan this and follow us. Leave a comment, right? And they're like, exactly. Just show serious? support. And that's the way it has been. That's what I'm saying. We've, we've changed the online game. We're going to change the show game. And the reality is when people come to these shows, they're paying to get in. And they should be leaving with something. With something, right? correct. I, I agree with you 100%. I am, right? And that's what it's about, man. So I'm glad to hear PRV chipped in. Obviously, we're a Topano distributor and online seller. Uh, and we, we bring, you know, their gear down with us. Yep. And manufacturers work through guys like us uh, to Kicker, Kenwood. All of them send us stuff to take and give out. Exactly. And you know what? Nobody should leave empty-handed. Nope. Uh, no matter if you like me or not, I'll still give it to you. Uh, it, it hurts. You know, I've had some comments sent, screenshots where people said, yeah, I just got the stuff to take it home to my kid. I couldn't give a crap. That's fine. I'm still giving it out. And you know what? Your kid liked it. So whatever. <laughs> that, that's good news here. But so your last, oh, you're saying your last brand was PRV. PRV was first. Um, okay. Then I went over to Crescendo. And now I'm with Rogue. Um, you whore. <laughs> as you can see. So one thing I'll tell you, I am a believer of. Oh, hold on. I'm going to defend you. Yep. You literally get hit. I had five today directly, not even through the company, about sponsoring. And then right away, I go to their page. There is nothing about me on there. There's nothing about a bill. No support. And yes. Right away. I'm not trying to be rude. You can be pissed off if you want, but you haven't even talked the name Big Jeff. And exactly. You you and then I go look him up in the computer and I said, I don't even see that you bought anything. Why would I help that? You haven't thing. even supported anything no. at all. YouTube people that we support, they were buying product from us. I found them. Um, you know, trust me. So it's not like you're jumping. You do the builds, you go to the shows. That's what they ask. 
and then you go on. It's up, you know. I'll tell you this straightforward. Every company that I've been sponsored from, I bought the pro before PRV sponsored me, 100%. I bought their product. If they exactly. noticed me, they sponsored me. Same with Crescendo. Rogue, I started out with them from the beginning, but I still supported the product. It was a partnership. You know what I'm saying? I still bought product before or that was sponsored. You know what I'm Very saying? Very rarely do manufacturers even, not even to service manufacturers just give away free equipment. Okay? Correct. You have to be very well known. Correct. Huge reach. Yep. Uh, it is called sponsoring. There is a deal, a discount. Not giveaway. <laughs> um, you know, and then there's smaller stuff like we just did with Mart's Digital. They weren't giving away a whole their amplifier, so they wanted to find a couple competing cars to invest into. Yes, about the amps, not huge, and we did that. We we picked some people and handed off to them, and they picked what they wanted. And that is a different type of sponsor. Correct. But exactly. Anyway, with us, we have an affiliate program where basically you share your link that goes to our site and you get paid five to 10, even sometimes higher percent for nothing. From the sales difference. I would yeah, rather yeah. see somebody show me they have a reach. They're bringing people to my platform and then I have no problem taking Giving care them of them. something in return. Exactly. 100%. So yep, yep. You know, it's an everyday thing. You hear it from every manufacturer, every distributor, and they just go person to person, whoever's going to do it. Um, and then the other thing is actually going there and competing and getting on show, you know, doing like we're doing here and talking. So yep. that's why these companies uh, want to do that for you. So, you know, you've uh, you've been working with Rogue. Uh, yep. You know, we had him on the podcast last week. Um, we told him all his shows to lock us in for sure. One, it's local too. I believe in him giving back to the kids. Correct. Uh, that's huge to me. We do toys for tots at our own shop. In fact, last year at the new shop when we moved there, two and a half truckloads of toys. No wow. lie. It was amazing. This year, I'm still going to collect for toys for tots, but we have a gazebo in our showroom. Some of y'all have seen. I want to fill that up with toys and then invite so many the local families down and let the kids pick their pick own what stuff. They want. That's, dope. You know, yeah, that's that's honestly my plan to give back this year. So that's, dope. You know, that's amazing. Awesome. So John, uh, just what he does, uh, you know, he's amazing, man. Honestly, he, he is. He's a good he dude. He really man. is. He's, he's a giver. I could, I can honestly say that. And that's one of my biggest things. Not even just with the company, him, Rolando. Um, they, they're, they're, they're personal. You know what I'm yeah. saying? You, you reach out, they respond. You know what right. I'm saying? From the biggest to the smallest, and. That's a big thing with me. If I have a company or if I'm working with someone, I want to know I'm not just a number. I want to yeah. kind of know I'm, I am I matter. You know what I'm saying? You know what? And it's hard. You know, and I feel bad sometimes. I try to respond as many people. Like it's, hard. it's hard. It's hard. We do, we do anywhere. We do about 5,000 orders a month. Okay. That's 5,000 people a month in orders. Not even all the online. We have a full store i've seen that ocala right team, yeah we have a full team that barely get done just replying the comments and it's it's obviously not me just in a day so i try to talk with people but we're not just e-commerce we also have I, I think close to 300 dealers shops that buy from us and right away oh i want to talk to you it's not that i'm being rude i have a company i'm running yeah and it's like calling I want to talk, I, I'm, that's why I have all these people, right? I have managers, I have employees to do all this. Stuff. Uh, but when you're close with people, you got to you got to connect, man, and that's a big thing. Okay. Hey, anybody have any questions for Dean or even myself? Go ahead and comment it up. We're doing good on time. We're having a fun night. Um, I'm looking at all these comments. We've been staying well over sixty people plus in all the different platforms. Uh, Ryan Ware, Big Jeff, Best Deal at Cardio. Thank you so much. Uh, William Simmons, hot topic. What is the hot topic, sir? Uh, <laughs> hot topic is is, is, that is, is that's the orange car. Um, okay, there it is. Oh, and, the hot topic uh, is a car. Yeah, okay. the hot topic specific that you just had the video okay. of. Right, yeah, and right. the reason okay. it's named that is because people can't believe, people always have questions. They can't believe the car's on airbags with all that music. They can't right. believe the car has so much music in it for that size and they can't believe the output and how far it's came within that there's people who follow that car from the beginning and it's scary because they're like oh dean i remember you and i'm like i have no idea who this is 
yeah. <laughs> and then they're like, yeah, you had the gray car and then you turned it, you wrapped it and then you painted it. And I'm yeah. like, wow, they really I know. Felt, I felt me. bad at the last, you know, sundown show. All these people come up to me and a lot of them think I'm the one responding to everybody and there's no crazy way I could. So I'm just straight up with people and just tell them, I'd be lying to you if I said I did, but now I do know you. you know exactly. I mean? I that, right? But, exactly. Uh, you got exactly. Wayne Fowler Jr. here. Dean, how's the SQ of road? Well, like I said there before, I've won three world championships <laughs> with Rogue. <laughs> I'm just going to put that out there. Um, and they are all sound quality, as you can see. So right. I, 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 I won't say... I, I'm not going to sit here and say, oh, they're they're um, they're the best of the best of the best. The best. Da, 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 da. I'm going to say I personally love them. I think they're one of the best. There's so many speakers that you could do. But between the people behind the company and the product behind the company, they're the best to me right now. That's that's what I could say. You know, uh, people ask all the time, what's the best? And yeah, I think we have about right at 40 brands. And my answer to everybody is. You got to find what's the best, best for you for, for you for and your, your budget, yes. right, and your vehicle. So, um, me personally, and I've had multiple cars with systems. I never had a car with just the same everything. I know. Um, I remember you told me that last time. Yeah, yes, you, you pick out what is best, and every out brand of each has, brand, has yes, mix, right. And you pick that out, and that's what you do. And then it's the same thing when people ask. It's a budget too. Not everybody can just Correct. drop that money. Um, so you have to build around your budget. And thankfully, there's a lot better product for less expensive prices these days. Uh, Big Jeff, Gale Force stated you guys that were at Crescendo. Big Jeff, did Gale Force get started from you guys? No, no, no. Gale Force, Al, uh, they were, I think, part of or worked for Crescendo. Crescendo, I don't know. yeah. yeah. Um, I met Al through actually Sean Mayo at Excess Power. Uh, at the time, they still are. Was a small company, two speakers. Um, I just liked him. Uh, I felt because they started with no investor, literally money out of their own pocket. Um, we actually uh, helped out on the new line coming out, so we did a big pre-order to help out on these new entry-level waterproofs that are. We'll actually have him on the podcast. Taylor, I'm about to pop you up on here. What is the date for Gale Force coming up? You're about to come on. Uh, I think October 6th. Okay, so Gale Force is actually coming on here because we're going to actually have the prototypes. Um, man, I'm going to tell you something. Alan, uh, you know, we had a problem with the podcast back then. I told everybody if they have their logo on there, they're not supporting us. They're supporting somebody talking crap. Alan took a big chance and, and rode on Big Jeff Audio, and that was big. So when he came to me about the new speakers, I didn't even hesitate. You know what I'm saying? I always believe in supporting the people that support you 100%. So a uh, uh, big shout out for him uh, at that. So great question. Uh, hot topic made me change my truck bed oil over. <laughs> so, um, I'll tell you about that. Um, he's a great friend. He's great. Um, I, I love people like this. So, you, I tell people, you get two types of people in this world. You get this type of person and this type of person. And that's that's what happens with music. And he's really one of these. He has a really nice build. Um, Rogue actually took us over to, we, I went with Rogue to Wake the Dead, the Wake the Dead car show in Arkansas, Arkansas, however it says. You went all the way out there. Yeah, we went, man, listen, we went all the way out there, all the way. And... It was amazing. Um, I get to. Well, I just want to ask, what was it like being black and Caribbean in Arkansas? <laughs> huh? it, was <laughs> it was nice. <laughs> um, so I, I actually got to meet some more black people in Hispanic, and right, I, right. I I was actually pretty scared. I was like, "Where are we going?" Right. And the name of the show is Wake Wake the Dead, Wake and the I'm, dead. Like, right. I'm, I'm like, like I'm, I'm like, like, yep. Rogue setting me up right now. This must yeah, be my man. last car show. I'm about to sign my car over. You know what right. I'm saying? <laughs> um, but it really was an amazing show. It was It was honestly, it was way better than I could ever expect it. There was a really good turnout. I got to meet people like Brandon. Um, He loved my car and he, he's been in contact ever since. And that's one thing I love about shows. I love meeting new people. I love bouncing ideas off of people. Like 
Dean, I see you did this. How about you ever tried this? Da, da, da. And I love it. And I myself, I can't answer everybody who inboxes me, but I try to. You know what I'm saying? I, I really do try to. Does music uh, or have, have a truck battle? If honestly, one, we're very, very innovative. So, yes. You gotta get enough people to. Yes. If we have enough people, yeah. I will create the category yeah. for it. But I guarantee. Whatever your maybe, truck is, it already work that with you. We can do some kind of um, survey, right? And we can use the pla our platform email. I mean, our emails are like I don't know fifty thousand. Engage people. bills and and see who would they be a part of it, right? Uh, one and two, any other ideas because uh, that'd be really cool. Yeah, sure. and we love we love like I said, we we started doing voce tales. That was something we don't do that in the islands. We just play music, but right. it was something big in Florida, so we adapted it. Bass, we always had bass, but we've never had bass on the level that it that I've seen like people doing right. one eighties and once. Listen, when I seen those type of numbers, I'm like. I didn't even know that was real. I didn't even know you could do a 60 when I was in the islands years ago. You know what I'm saying? And people were here. Those guys, man, it's uh they do it for real. Yeah, it's a different bill. I mean, it's it is. For it sure. is. And I personally, I hit a 60 for the first time out of my little Civic, and that was amazing. Um, mm -hmm. That's the highest I've ever reached in it. Um, but like I said, I don't meter for a living. I don't bass I, I really don't care what the bass does on the meter i care what it sounds like when i play my entire right right, right right um Correct. if you haven't done it go ahead and uh comment the word hater 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 hater, hater. and you will win <laughs> a double din 6.2 tonight um we'll close that off Let's pull up the winner and let Dean announce the touchscreen double din. Please be an easy name. Ryan Ware. Did you just say please be an easy name? <laughs> I'm going to make sure next time you're on here, I'm going to set up somebody <laughs> fake just to make you say it. Uh, Ryan Ware, congratulations. Contact 737. We have Aaliyah, our customer service manager, who I think has a crush on Dean. <laughs> we'll take care of you and get you sent out with that touchscreen double then congratulations you know man it was actually a really good show we we were up still over 75 people uh this is a new night friday so uh, even john rogue uh that well we have it post on two different youtubes now but total was you know in the thousands and it's awesome you know you can see when people get even in the comments it's exciting to have somebody like you dean you're infectious i ain't gonna lie Thank you're you. just straight up good-hearted dude there's nothing fake about that you can tell it's not a show um you know that's just people i want in my life you know what i mean um what does it say ryan where i should call yeah they're, they're <laughs> kind of he's getting his gift. Words, but no they're closed the phones don't come back on you can always send a text then also ryan but uh monday 8 a.m to 4 p.m eastern Standard time and and i mean that dean seriously you're good thank people, you man. honestly and think, thank you you know, that's going to relate into the show. I'm stoked about going. My team is, you know, we're stoked about following this with you, especially being in our hometown uh, and not far away. And that's just an awesome thing. Everybody on your night, uh, it looks like we had a great time. This is what it's supposed to be about. This is actually episode 20, 20 episodes. Uh, man, you know, when we started this, it was really out of a stupid idea to get back at somebody. And it turned into be just, an awesome thing, man. All the people we've met, interviewed from different brands, even brands like Rogue that we don't even carry. It's not about right, that. Right. This is big sound. Yeah, we throw in some plugs and talk about the company, but why not? But it's about this and the the yeah, people. Networking, uh, exactly. Man, it, it's awesome. So I really enjoy it. I'm so thankful. Uh, it is a weekend. We did pass another night with Dean Baptist and also the pre-show if you're interested dean how do they how do they how do they get to you if they don't know um you can hit me up on facebook musical wars um straight directly to the musical wars page musical right. so wars. You go and you search <laughs> music wars you'll find us yep. you can obviously go to our page and go to the event section yep. it is in there for sure um if you haven't liked please like the this now wherever you're watching if you haven't subscribed the like button follow us 100 that's what we work for um 
All of our social medias are forward slash or at Big Jeff Audio. Um, if you're interested in the new hair tricks hat uh, with our new, uh, I don't call it a logo because my face is the logo. I think this is going to be the car show logo um, and we're going to be doing more and more. They're on the website now. I think they're, I don't know, 25 bucks or something like that. Um, and uh, stay tuned for the new hater starter kits. Uh, they will allow you to put the hater blockers on and laugh about the chain and just enjoy car audio like we should all be. Um, you know, thank you so much, Dean, man. Um, thank you. Thank you for having what me. What I to do is after the show, have you back on after my guys start to do the highlights and the videos. Perfect. And what we can do is bring some up and talk about it. You know what I'm saying? That'd be yeah, really cool. that'd be dope. And uh, I think hopefully us being a part this time can help during the planning. Oh, yeah. next one, and I'd mm -hmm. love to be a part of that for sure. So Perfect. as usual, I don't like to keep everybody. We stay on time. Uh, I think we got it all in. Uh, if you have any questions last minute, put them up here now. If not, we're going to just uh, call it a night. Enjoy our Friday night. I'm Big Jeff from Big Sound by Big Jeff saying good night. Ben, take her out. Another show in the bag. Yeah, that's a wrap. Big Sound is the best and it ain't no cap. Hit the website if you need that merch. It's Big Jeff Audio and hit the search. I know you had fun, yeah, you gotta admit it. That boy Big Jeff took his thing and he did it. Always a win, yeah, never a L. Did you smash the like, subscribe, and hit the bell? Share it on your socials, put it on blast. We'll be back next week with another podcast. Big sound in the house like no other deviant Big Jeff.